Now let's look at the last device needed in our basic service brake system, the stoplight switch, an air-operated on-off electrical switch. Generally, a switch is used in each of the service circuits. Two are used in case of a failure in either brake circuit. The Bendix SL5 stoplight switch is comprised of a body, a non-removable, non-metallic cover, piston, diaphragm, two contact strips with attached terminals, and a shorting bar. During a brake application, air flowing to the brake actuators or relay valve also reaches the stoplight switch inlet. Air pressure is immediately present beneath the SL5's diaphragm. When application pressure reaches or exceeds 6 PSI, the diaphragm moves, carrying the piston into contact with the shorting bar. With continued movement, the shorting bar snaps into contact with the terminals, completing the circuit and lighting the stoplights. Upon release of the brakes, air is exhausted from beneath the SL5 diaphragm, the shorting bar loses contact with the terminals, and the electrical circuit is broken.